representing here. First off, hello one and all, this is So Hellkite, and welcome to the uh, inactive channel. My god, a nun's sex life has, is more active than my channel. The first thing we're going to talk about is, is kind of like what's actually happened with the computer. I'll kind of keep it very quick and to the point. Uh, basically, I was doing footage for Dauntless, as you saw the two videos, and it's not been a while since I've actually uploaded any more content. Because the computer started acting very weird. I was using OBS to record. And OBS seems like one of them programs where it's just good for streaming. Uh, unless you've got like a really high-end computer, recording is just bad. I mean, my computer is really good. It's, it's really, really good, thanks to you guys. It's got like high RAM, an amazing graphics card, all these little, little gizmos inside to make it run for a YouTuber to actually run. And I can actually run some really strong games and record at the same time without actually going bork. So I got a new, and I got a new uh, recording software and uh, everything was running fine. I know as I was going to do some more footage, the computer started acting really weird. It wasn't opening programs. The sound wasn't actually working. It was really confusing. And then this happened. Uh, it basically would loop into this blue screen all the time. And I thought, ah, oh. the only get thing I could think about that was maybe cause this. Maybe you guys haven't had it if you play the game. Maybe it's just me. And that is Monster Hunter Frontier and Dragon's Dogma Online. These are Japanese games, but the amount of hassle I had to do to download these, it was such a pain. And I was going to do content for Frontier, but it got to a point where I just couldn't, I don't want to risk it anymore. I don't want to get to the point where my computer is going to Maybe if, if you guys have any issues, fair enough. But for me, I just want to be a bit careful and uh, go back to the old sort of thing with the channel. Like I said, I'm going to cover Dauntless and more Monster Hunter as well. Pushing forward for the content, this is a, a, an idea I've had for such a long time. And I've actually had it since the first time I started YouTube. And uh, as proof, what I, what I did, I actually spammed a lot of YouTubers back in the day. Even when I first started doing YouTube, I didn't know it was a bad thing. Like, uh, messaging these YouTubers with like the same thing, and of course it would pick up the spam bot, and then it would put it into spam. Oh, silly me, silly young Hellkai, I didn't know that, did I? But basically, I'd message all these Monster Hunter YouTubers, because what I wanted to start was a top 5 series, getting epic highlights and fails. I've always wanted to do this sort of series, and yeah, as you can see, maybe in the past, I did do some videos, if you've been here for a while, with the Destiny and stuff, and it didn't really work out, because it wasn't really my niche. But Monster Hunter is my niche, as you guys know. It's my, it's the channel that grew into this thing, and you guys have helped me a part for this as well. I am a quote-unquote big Monster Hunter YouTuber, which is kind of weird to actually think that that I'm actually recognised in the Monster Hunter community. So uh, it's it's still pretty weird to think that. And again, that's all thanks to your help. As yeah, well. I've wanted to do a top five series for Monster Hunter for such a long time because I think you have all these people tell these amazing stories that they've done. And other than A, not, they couldn't capture it because, you, you know, to, you need to spend so much money to get a capture card installed to your DS. And no one has the time or the patience to do that. Or the money, sorry. And a lot of these people are not going to sit there on a computer all the time recording the DS until something happens. They go, Arr! And like, and like me, like I said, you can hit a few buttons and record the last 10 minutes. But that is not the case anymore. With Monster Hunter World coming out, it is so easy to get hold of footage. So easy. With the Xbox, the PlayStation 4 and PC, you can get the last few minutes saved just by with the push of a button or just talking to your console. I know I did it with my Xbox and I know a couple of friends of mine have got that sort of feature and I know with the PC that has something called a Nvidia thing called Shadowplay that can record the last three, five, ten minutes depending how far you want to go. Not sure about consoles. But this is where it stands now. This is what this is what the channel what I want to do for the channel. I really want to do this because uh, then you guys can be, you know be a part of my channel and show off the sort of things, and then the more the monster in the community can get involved, and I can start you know doing this amazing sort of highlight reels and epic fails in Monster Hunter World. I want to be the first channel that does this thing for Monster Hunter. It's not the first you know idea to do the top five reels, but I want to be the one the first guys to do it for Monster Hunter, and I can't do that without your guys' help. I know a lot of you guys are really skilled and funny hunters who can do some really funny things and if you get footage I want it so I can show the what you know the monster community how epic or how much of a scrubby person you are if you want to send that anyways I want to see your footage if you get anything cool with the footage I want it of course when I get closer to the date when monster Hunter, if the demo comes out if it doesn't or if we do get the game come out I will have an email 
that you can send the videos to or uh, you guys can just literally send it directly to my YouTube accounts email before it gets spammed. I don't know, but that's the plan for the channel anyway, guys. Of course, I will continue to do videos in the process with, of course, DS games, Don't Want Less, and other, thing, other games as well that I fancy doing as well. And I have seen all your suggestions on Discord. I have looked at all of them. It was just some of them are like, yes, some of them are not no, but it's, it's all depending on my internet when I actually get that installed as well. But anyway, thank you so much, guys, for watching me rant about my problems and how much of a scrubby person I am. Uh, take care, guys, and you guys have an awesome day. Okay, bye-bye.